Hello, this is Patrick Brunel of Brilliant Directories, and in today's video we're going to talk about customizing your website using the new Bootstrap theme. Some of the features that we're going to see is how you can go ahead and edit the main menus. You can edit what type of search it is, whether it's a keyword search. You can make it a, you can easily change the hero image or make it a slider. This homepage dividers, you can call up different streaming widgets very easily. You can add a custom section, have an events calendar and so forth. So this software really comes with uh, a lot of options that allow you to easily control every aspect of the design of your site. So this is going to be a quick intro video. We're not going to go in depth over any one of these particular features, but we're just going to show you the different areas where you can control what you see. So the first thing we'll do is go and check out the new design settings that come with this theme. In all, you have over a hundred point and click uh, options. You can easily change the background colors, the font colors, the font type, uh, the font size, and so forth of different sections throughout your website. Uh, whether it be in the footer design, the header design, and so forth. You can also uh, select from a pre-made color set. So this is a quick way to, to see different looks and, and find one that matches with your particular brand. It also gives you an easy to edit homepage layout where you can change the hero image, easily select the type of search that you would like people to use in order to find information on your website. Uh, you can change the H1, which is the main title of the website, the instructions, the fonts, the font size, and so forth, just like the other sections. Something else that's great is um, you can easily order which streaming widgets you'd like to have on your homepage. And the way that you do that is edit them here in the whole page section order. So first I'll want to have recent coupons or recent events. So it's very easy to select which widget you'd like to display where. It also gives you an option to put in the custom homepage content. So if you have custom code that you'd like to appear on the homepage, you put that in the homepage itself with your custom code and it'll pull that custom code and include it in the homepage. So it's easier than ever to include a custom section to your homepage design. We'll also take a quick look at the slideshow settings, which allows you to quickly create a slideshow. A lot of our customers prefer to have a slideshow. Uh, so it just takes a few moments to upload the images and select how many images you'd like to have and the intervals that you'd like to have in between those particular uh, images, as well as the type of transition effect that you'd like. So a lot of control there. And of course, as always, we have our custom CSS and custom head sections that allows you to insert code that will be spread out throughout the entire website. We're also going to take a couple seconds and have a look at the branding where you can easily upload your website logo and favicon. And now it's also easier than ever to upload a default member photo and a default member logo. This is useful in case you don't want to have this silhouette of a person as the default image should you have members that you've imported and they haven't selected an image. So it adds a bit of color to your website so it gives you more control over what happens there. We also have a keyword search controller. This is brand new for this theme. We're very excited about it. What you're able to do now is have full control over what type of information is shown in the auto suggest. So when a visitor your website comes to your homepage and starts typing, do you want it to show members? Do you want it to show your categories? Do you want it to show coupons? Do you want it to show articles? How many articles would you like it to show? Do you want it to link directly to the article? Do you want it to show the header? Do you want it to include the location and so forth? Uh, and it's just a matter of dragging and dropping the order of them that you'd like them to be. Uh, and again, giving you complete control over the auto suggest, which essentially is the primary uh, purpose of your website is to help people find information that they're looking for. We'll take a quick look at the create a page section. Uh, with this platform, you can create unlimited web pages. Uh, here, you're able to enter your uh, HTML code, uh, bootstrap code. You're able to edit some custom CSS, and you're able to put some head tags, if need be, in that particular page. And it also includes a custom SEO section here that you're able to enter that SEO, such as your page titles, keywords, and description. We'll take a quick look at the widget library. Uh, it comes with uh, 183 pre-made widgets, but more importantly, allows you to create custom widgets extremely easily. If you're a developer, you're gonna love this. All you do is click on new widget, you insert a widget name, 
and each widget allows you to put in the widget code itself. So you can put in your PHP in there, for example. It allows you to apply some CSS to that widget. And if you need to, enter some JavaScript code right here. And calling a widget is extremely easy. You can call a widget in a page. You can call a widget within a widget. Uh, our system's extremely powerful for any developers that want to be able to utilize their custom uh, code. Uh, we'll also have a quick look at the text labels. So very easily, uh, you can replace some very commonly used text labels, some variables that are used all throughout the site to make the website dynamic. So you can easily replace uh, terms such as business with law firm, for example. And everywhere it says uh, local business, it would now say local law firm. So it's a very quick way to make drastic uh, changes to the text labels of your website very quickly. It just takes a few moments. And finally, we're going to have a look at the sidebar manager. Uh, you're going to love this. You're able to completely customize existing sidebars or create custom sidebars. Uh, if we'll, let's take a look at the uh, member profile page sidebar. It's going to show you the widgets that are currently uh, selected or are currently showing on your profile pages. You can rearrange the order of those widgets and you can easily drag and drop any widget you like into that sidebar, uh, making it extremely easy to customize sidebars, which is a, a big part of your website as well. So once you get into it, you have an incredible amount of control uh, with regards to designing your website. You even have a quick access to your cPanel and MySQL. Uh, you'll see with a click of a button, I can log into PHP my admin. And just like that, I can access my entire database, including my user's data table. I can easily search all of these different tables. I can export them. I can make backups. I can call them. Uh, whatever it is I need to do, I have full access to my database. So really, this is an extremely powerful and flexible platform. Uh, you can get as advanced as you like, uh, whether you're a, a beginner and you can make a, an incredible website just like you see here. This is a beginner level website, or if you really want to get creative, you really want to get deep into that code, you're able to do it with this platform. I hope this was helpful, and I certainly look forward to seeing you in the next video.